Oh, hi there. Welcome to my channel. My name is Leah and I love makeup. Today I am opening the Allure Beauty Box. This is the very first one I've ever gotten, so I have no idea what's in here. If you want to see what's in this box that I think I paid $10 for, stay tuned. When you first open the Allure Beauty Box, it looks like this. So inside is their little like magazine and I'm sure a coupon and then it comes in this like makeup bag that is, um, I don't know how to explain it. It's like really thin and kind of like cheap feeling. I feel like this would actually be pretty good to travel with and put your brushes in maybe um, because it's probably very waterproof. But let's take a look what's inside. Okay, this is the little magazine thing that comes with it. Every beauty box has one. Like this is um, Boxy Charms. They always put one card in that's got, you know, tells you everything that's in it and what the value is. All right, so let's open this guy. Um, first, I got a sheet mask, and this is the Marmond Flower Lab Essence Mask in Narcissus. This. Okay. It says it is a moisturizing mask that helps replenish the skin with bountiful moisture. It has a serum type essence and flower filtering care effect. Okay. So it's um, a flower mask. Nice. Okay. Next up is the Model Co Metallic Eyeshadow Trio in Mykonos. Let's take a look and open it. Uh, this says it is a value of $15. And... It's burgundy, pinky, champagne, and brown to cre create a sheer wash of glittering color. Um, so it's all shimmers. They're pretty. Um, it's kind of nice that it's so small. Let's just see how they feel. They're very tiny, tiny little pans. So here is the brown shade. Here is the kind of peachy shade. And here is the burgundy shade. Ooh, that one feels a little rough. The colors are nice. I could definitely see using these with other shadows. Um, yeah, they're pretty. So I'm not mad at this one. This one is a $15 value. Next is another skincare item. This is the Mamond Petal Spa Oil to Foam Cleanser. This is actually one that I'm very excited to try out. Um, I'm reading just a little bit about this. It is a, um, this would be like your oil cleansing step in your facial cleansing system. So I'm excited to try this one. It's got rose petal in it, which is so good for your skin. So this looks like it's a deluxe trial size. It says that the full size value is $21. Um, so this would be significantly less. This one is actually not in the little book, so I can't tell you what it's worth, but it is a Mally Evercolor Shadow Stick Extra. And it is in the shade Burnished Bronze. It's another shimmery shadow. It is right there. So it actually will kind of go along with these, and it's supposed to be pretty long lasting, I guess, is what it says. Ever color, so it means it's going to last forever. Oh, well, I mean, it blends a little. We'll let it dry down and see how it actually, I could see that it's going to last quite a bit but it does blend when you first put it on. Um, it's a pretty color. I'm not sure if I like this kind of application. I'll try it out and see how it works. Ooh, okay, I'm actually excited about this next one. It is the Brow Gal um, Instant Insta Tint Tinted Brow Gel. This is a $22 value. Um, I'm actually really excited about this one because I got one of these in a BoxyCharm before, but it was like a blonde shade, so it did not work for me at all. And this one is in brown, so I think this will work much better. Um, I liked the other one because it has such a like little teeny tiny little brush. So I'm excited to try this now that I have a color that will probably actually match and be usable. I've heard so many good things about that. So getting a full size one of these is kind of awesome. Next is a single brush. This is the Moda Metals Triad Eyeshadow Brush. It says the soft, precise shading brush is the holy grail of eyeshadow brushes. This is a $4.99 value and oh, it is very soft. It's nice to just get a good brush every once in a while. Like that's one thing I liked about BoxyCharm so much is that there was pretty much always brushes in it. So getting, I love, I love a brush. Not mad at this, five bucks. 
All right, next we have a Mally. I've never used this brand before. It's Mally High Shine Liquid Lipstick, and this is in the shade Blossom. Um, apparently you can get it on QVC, and this is a $21 value. It looks like a really pretty shimmery pink that, let's, ooh, it's a brush. I'm surprised. It's kind of crushed. So usually this type of lipstick, you'll get a doe foot applicator and not a brush applicator, but ooh, that's sticky. It's a pretty light pink and it is not as shimmery as it looks in the tube, but I can tell just from applying it, it's a really sticky formula. So it's probably gonna be very high shine. Um, so that's a $21 value, not bad. And finally, the one I am most excited about. This is the Wander Beauty Mile High Mascara. It is in the shade Ultra Black, I guess. Um, it doesn't say on the tube, but it's what it says in the little book. And this is a $26 value. And if you've ever watched any of my other videos, you know that I like the Unlashed from Wander Beauty. So I'm very excited to try this one. It's supposed to do really good length, volume, and lift. This is what the brush looks like. So you can definitely get into all of your little crevasses on your eyes. So I'm very excited to try this one out. Keep a lookout on that in the next video. All right, so I went and added up everything. The total value of the box is a little bit over $100. I paid $10.75 for the box. Um, it was $10 for your first box plus tax, I think. Um, I know that shipping is included. I will say that there have been a few snafus as far as billing goes. So I signed up in February and I had two charges right away. They refunded the one. And then I think this is the February box. Um, and then I got charged again the other day, which was, should be for the March box. So we'll see if that one is coming. But that one also only charged me 1075. So I'm not really sure what's going on. <laughs> they're new, so I think they're figuring things out. Okay, the weird billing stuff aside, I think this is a pretty good value. I mean, you got these two skincare things and then all of these products here for about $10 and monthly it's $15. Um, I like the idea of it because it's from Allure, so they have a different selection of brands that they have access to than a few other beauty boxes. So I'm gonna let this run for a couple of months and see what keeps coming in and see if this is a good um, choice. I have to say BoxyCharm has not been like knocking it out of the park for me lately, so that's why I wanted to try this one to see if it's gonna be a better option maybe for me because it is about $5 a month cheaper. All right, you guys, so that is the Allure Beauty Box. What do you think? I think for 10 bucks, it's not bad. For 15 still, it's not bad. Um, if you wanna check it out for yourself, I think they're still doing the um, first box for $10 thing. I'll put a link down below. It's not an affiliate link or anything, so I don't get anything. It's just the link right to the store. Let me know what you think about this box in the comments below. Is this something you're gonna try or is there another box that you like even better that maybe I should look at? Definitely let me know. And with that, I thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button because it really helps out my channel and I would love you forever. All right, have a super great rest of your day and we'll see you in the next video. Bye, 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 bye.